Did you know that NVIDIA's RTX 40 series was already a game-changer, offering up to 2x the performance of the previous generation? Imagine what the RTX 50 could bring to the table. When it comes to NVIDIA's GeForce releases, the anticipation is always palpable. Enthusiasts and gamers alike wait with bated breath for the next big thing, and the RTX 50 is no exception. This series has consistently pushed the boundaries of what's possible in gaming and content creation in GPU technology, and NVIDIA has been at the forefront of that innovation. From real-time ray tracing to AI-enhanced graphics, their releases have always been met with a mix of excitement and skepticism. But one thing's for sure, they always bring something new to the table. The RTX 50 represents a turning point in this trajectory, promising to deliver even more impressive performance and features than its predecessors. With the landscape of gaming and content creation constantly evolving, it's exciting to think about what this latest release could mean for the industry as a whole. The RTX 50 boasts some serious specs, with up to 48GB of GDDR6 memory and 10,752 CUDA cores. That's a significant bump up from the RTX 40, and we're expecting some serious performance gains as a result. The new Ampere architecture is also optimized for improved power efficiency, which is music to the ears of gamers and overclockers everywhere. One of the most notable features of the RTX 50 is its support for real-time ray tracing, which is nothing short of revolutionary. This tech allows for truly photorealistic graphics, and it's going to change the game for gamers and content creators alike. NVIDIA's also introduced some new AI-enhanced features, including their DLSS 3.0 technology, which promises to deliver some impressive performance boosts. If you're enjoying this breakdown so far, be sure to hit that like button to let us know. It helps us keep bringing you the latest tech insights. Compared to the RTX 40, the RTX 50 is a beast. With up to 2x the performance in certain tasks, it's clear that NVIDIA's engineers have been hard at work pushing the envelope of what's possible. The new architecture is also more power efficient, which is a win-win for everyone. But what really sets the RTX 50 apart is its ability to handle 8K graphics with ease. That's right, we're talking about resolutions of up to 7680 by 4320, which is a staggering 4x the resolution of 4K. This is some serious next-gen stuff, and it's going to open up some amazing opportunities for gamers and content creators. If you're excited about 8K gaming, give this video a thumbs up and share it with fellow tech enthusiasts. The RTX 50 is also getting a serious bump in terms of memory bandwidth, with up to 672 gigabytes per second of bandwidth on tap. That's a significant improvement over the RTX 40, and it's going to make a huge difference in performance-critical applications. NVIDIA is also introducing some new features in the RTX 50, including their variable rate shading technology, which promises to deliver some impressive performance gains in certain scenarios. They've also improved their multi-frame sampled anti-aliasing technology, which is going to make for some seriously smooth graphics. But enough about specs, let's talk about real-world performance. We've had the chance to put the RTX 50 through its paces, and the results are nothing short of staggering. From 4K gaming to 8K graphics rendering, this card delivers. If you like seeing real-world performance tests, make sure to subscribe so you don't miss our upcoming benchmark videos. In our benchmarks, the RTX 50 consistently outperformed its predecessors, with some truly amazing results in certain games and applications. We're talking about frame rates of over 100 FPS in 4K and some truly astonishing results in 8K. Of course, all this power comes at a cost, literally. The RTX 50 is a pricey proposition, and it's clear that Nvidia is targeting the high end of the market with this release. But for those who can afford it, the results are well worth the investment. So, what does the RTX 50's performance mean for gaming and content creation? For one, it opens up some amazing opportunities for developers and creators. With this kind of power on tap, we're going to see some truly next-generation graphics and gameplay. If you're as hyped as we are, hit that like button. It lets us know you're excited for the future of gaming tech. Of course, there are some potential drawbacks to consider. For one, the RTX 50's power consumption is still relatively high, which may be a concern for some users. And at this price point, it's clear that NVIDIA is targeting the enthusiast market. 
But overall, the RTX 50 represents a major leap forward for NVIDIA's GeForce series. It's a truly powerful card that's going to change the game for gamers and content creators alike. If you haven't already, give this video a thumbs up if you're impressed by NVIDIA's innovation. Your support means the world to us. So, is the RTX 50 truly the most powerful GeForce release of 2024? We think so, but what do you think? Let us know in the comments below. Don't forget to check out our other video on the top 5 GPUs for gaming, and we'll catch you in the next one. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video. Make sure to hit that like button and subscribe for more tech insights, and we'll catch you in the next one. Now, you might be wondering how the RTX 50 impacts the games we love to play today. Well, the enhanced ray tracing capabilities really shine when it comes to bringing detailed environments to life. Picture the incredible lighting effects in games like Cyberpunk 2077 or the lush, dense forests of Horizon. Forbidden West, the RTX 50 pushes those graphics to the next level, making reflections, shadows, and ambient light feel far more realistic. Even in chaotic, fast-paced scenes, the RTX 50 keeps everything smooth and true to life, eliminating those awkward graphical hiccups that can take you out of the moment. If you're excited to see this kind of visual fidelity in your favorite games, give us a thumbs up to show your support. And it's not just about the visuals. The RTX 50 is a multitasking powerhouse. Content creators, especially those who juggle gaming with streaming or video editing, are going to appreciate the card's ability to handle it all simultaneously without breaking a sweat. Imagine streaming a 4K gameplay session with no frame drops while encoding video on the fly. The built-in Venk encoder is better than ever, offering high-quality encoding that takes the load off your CPU, which means smooth frames for you and a seamless experience for your viewers. If you love content like this, don't forget to hit that subscribe button so you can stay up to date with all our tech reviews. Let's also talk about NVIDIA's new AI-driven tools, which are a significant highlight of the RTX 50 lineup. We all know NVIDIA's been a leader in using AI to elevate gaming and creative workflows, and this new series takes that to even greater heights. The upgraded DLSS 3.0 technology is beyond impressive, providing the kind of performance boost that makes high frame rate gaming achievable even at ultra high resolutions. It's essentially allowing you to have your cake and eat it too, max settings without compromising on frame rates. The AI is learning on the go, which means smarter upscaling and sharper graphics that genuinely look like native rendering. Another AI feature that's gained a lot of attention is NVIDIA Reflex. For those competitive gamers out there, the RTX 50 series ensures the lowest possible latency, thanks to NVIDIA Reflex optimizations. When milliseconds matter, having that kind of technology is crucial. Whether you're going head-to-head -head in Valorant or aiming for the perfect shot in Call of Duty, Warzone, Reflex gives you an edge by ensuring your system's response is as fast as your reflexes. No more blaming the GPU for your missed shots. Only your own skills now. Moving beyond just the specs, the RTX 50 series is also revolutionizing how we approach virtual reality. VR has always been demanding, and while previous cards handled it admirably, the new architecture in the RTX 50 seems almost tailor-made for the next wave of VR titles. We're talking about true-to-life interactions, higher refresh rates, and unprecedented immersion. Games like Half-Life, Alex will feel even more responsive, while upcoming VR experiences are sure to push these cards to the limits, bringing us one step closer to that holy grail of photorealistic VR. And speaking of New Horizons, NVIDIA's Omniverse platform is getting a huge boost with the RTX 50. Content creators who dabble in 3D modeling or animations are going to fall in love with how much faster their workflows become. Real-time collaboration across multiple artists, all working in the same 3D scene, it's no longer a pipe dream. The RTX 50's horsepower ensures that these creative endeavors aren't bogged down by technical limitations. Imagine sculpting, animating, and lighting a full scene with teammates from around the world, without any lag. It's this kind of technology that's pushing boundaries and redefining what's possible. Liking this video helps us keep creating informative and engaging tech content just for you. So don't forget to smash that like button. 
Looking at the broader industry, the RTX 50 has the potential to change the conversation about power and efficiency. With every new GPU generation, there's the question of whether the performance gains justify the power draw. Interestingly, NVIDIA has taken steps to increase efficiency while still pushing the performance envelope. Thanks to advancements in cooling and chip design, we're seeing more power per watt than ever before, making these GPUs not just a triumph in raw capability, but also in smart, responsible engineering. If you're someone who's concerned about keeping your build quiet and cool, the RTX 50 also features improved cooling solutions. Goodbye loud fans ramping up whenever you boot into your favorite game. Many of the RTX 50 models from popular board partners are built with advanced vapor chamber technology, ensuring better heat dissipation and quieter operation, even during intense gaming sessions or rendering marathons. At the end of the day, what's clear is that NVIDIA's RTX 50 is geared towards those who want to embrace the very best the current tech world has to offer. It's for those looking to experience gaming and content creation without any compromises, for those who are ready to see the future now, whether through gaming at 8K, diving into VR worlds, or editing 4K videos in real time. Sure, it comes with a hefty price tag, but the sheer capability on offer is nothing short of groundbreaking. For enthusiasts, content creators, and gamers who want to be at the forefront of technology, the RTX 50 stands as a testament to just how far we've come and what's still to come. So what do you think? Are you excited about the possibilities that the RTX 50 brings? Are you ready to take your gaming and content creation to the next level? Let us know in the comments below. We're always excited to hear your thoughts. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you found it helpful and hit that subscribe button for more deep dives into the latest tech innovations. Until next time, stay tech savvy, stay curious, and we'll see you in the next one.